Okay, so I'm going to show you what the laser looks like when it's cutting the pattern. I've chosen to use French walnut for the background of this pattern that I'm making. So here you go, and have fun watching. The laser that I have is a 25 watt laser, it's a game tree style, um, it'll cut up to 4 foot by 8 foot, and what I'm using is a little bit longer focal length so I get a tighter spot, and I'm laser cutting on a honeycomb vacuum hold down. So those are the scrap pieces from the pattern, which are kind of neat. I might save them and do something with them. But this is what I was actually going for, is to get this piece. Okay, so I've positioned the veneer on the laser so you could watch it cut. So I'm gonna hit run and let you watch. So when I set up the files for these, what I typically will do, and when I'm designing them, is I like the green to flow in a certain way uh, in the parts that I'm cutting. So I, I spend a lot of attention to kind of figure out when I'm laying it out, um, how to keep the green oriented so that when I put it together, it has a lot more character. enough to do this work for a job for 25 years. I used to do the work for some really high-end furniture companies. That's when that existed. People don't seem to buy furniture that's really high quality as much as they used to. But um, I'd like to see a lot more energy put into the detailing of things than I think uh, people are normally looking for. They like the rough, rustic style, but I really like polished, tight, interesting, carved, kind of decorative furniture. You know, one of the things is too, I've done this for a long time, and right now I'm just doing it freelance. So I used to have a company that I had several people doing this with me. And long story, I had to shut that down. But. I've had the privilege of doing this for a long time and I used to be really worried about teaching other people how to do the craft. So I, I'm mostly self-taught, but you know, I realized that if I can share what I know with somebody else, it just makes me happy. 
just because I love doing it. And even though sometimes I've suffered for the art of it. It makes me happy when I do it. So why wouldn't I want to share that? So right now I'm just taping the pieces back in just to hold them so they don't break on me. And then in my next little video snippet I'll show you how I put them together. But that's basically how it comes off the laser like that. Yeah, I really like that wood. It's pretty awesome.